This is Mark Morris, and you are watching ohdearyme.com. sunglasses and close your eyes please now I want you to picture your dream festival what's going on at your dream festival everyone I'm, I'm backstage <laughs> I'm in the jacuzzi I've got uh, I've got the cricket on and there's a game of roulette going on my personal dream festival um, has got well I think it's got lots of people who are no longer there there'll be water balloons <laughs> uh, tents we're chilling out backstage with dismemberment plan we've just done <laughs> a just in a set together with Cornelius and Radiohead Basically, all the bands we really like, just all on stage at the same time. <laughs> In front of like tens of thousands of people, that'd be cool. Lady Gaga. Lady Gaga's there. Is she, you She's big just fan? doing the catering. Oh, is she? Yeah. What in? In that marquee, not unlike this one. What's she wearing? Oh, what's she wearing? She's dressed down, so she's just wearing uh, a snow leopard that's been s turned inside out. To stay. It's got the young incredible string band, it's got the Beatles. Um, it's got the Beatles but not playing music that they played when they played live. It's got the Beatles playing live from 68 after they'd stopped touring, but they're all getting on with each other. It's 1997 and uh, Kinnicky have just played. Symposium we're gonna play in a bit and Cable are going to play and I'm just, oh, I can't even, I'm so excited. It's just the best day of my life. Brilliant. Actually, and I'm at Joe's Festival. <laughs> What's around you? Discount beer. <laughs> <laughs> It's our first show since December of any kind, and we, ha we, we hadn't rehearsed until this week. We hadn't, and it's the longest we've ever gone in our career, nearly six months without playing together. Uh, so I think we were a bit nervous at first, but we just warmed into it. I think two or three songs in, and we were fine. I, and I really enjoyed it. The crowd were really receptive. Very warm, weren't they? Yeah. Because they're going to miss you because you're. This is the farewell tour, isn't it? So I think some of them are going to miss us. The rest of them are going. Who, who are these guys again? I heard that you're leaving early tonight. Yeah. Because you have lamb shank cooking at home. Yeah. <laughs> That's terrible. So you're going to miss the blue tones. I'm going to have to tell the blue tones this when I interview them. It's my favourite meal. I really have to have it. <laughs> this is your mum cooking for you. Yeah. How old are you? 21. <laughs> and you should be able to go to an all week of like weekend festival and just kind of Leave eat crisps or pot noodles. I don't even got money to buy crisps <laughs> or pot noodles. So. So we're going to blag you something. We're going to do. This is a blag blog. So let's see, they haven't got any money for crisps or noodles. Alex has to leave to go and get his mother to cook him dinner. So this, we'll see if we get something for free, whether he still wants to stay or not. So this is Panda and, Pandas and People, about to blag some free foods. I don't, I don't know how... <laughs> Hello. Basically, I'm in a situation where I've got no money and I'm starving and uh, I'm just trying to blag some food. <laughs> Um, we're ohdearyme.com, 
Uh, we're with a band called Pandas and People, and we're just wondering if you would give them some free food so they can review it. Right, we have beggars, do we? Yeah. You guys are basically begging. We're reviewing. Reviewing. Uh, that's another word for begging. <laughs> um, I feel like I'm having to do all the work here. <laughs> I'm not really much of a talker. What about him? He's done nothing. <laughs> what what do you think about getting free stuff? Do you think it's blagging? Do you think it's... Like, he just called us a beggar. How do you feel about it? I think you should uh, help everybody out. We're all brothers and sisters. We all need food. We're all poor. You know, they're, they're charging a pretty expensive amount. <laughs> I think, you know, a bit of help. It's, uh, well, it's obviously going to be, their company's going to be on, on free advertisement, so that's not really begging though, is it? No. Do you think that we might have done better if you had been more famous? Definitely. I think this is your fault, isn't it, for not being famous enough? Yeah, we're just a humble little, little bands. <laughs> but you shouldn't be too proud to ask, should you? Definitely not. Hey. Well, here we are, guys. Enjoy. Badass. Uh, that's the Caldine, the coconut based curry, and that is the Goan curry. Okay, great. Uh, the more you've got, the more people give you. The Queen never has to fish into her pocket for a five pound note to pay for a, for a round of, well, one drink you get for a five an hour. You know, she doesn't have to pull out a pound coin with a head on it to buy a Mars bar. She's got everything and she's given millions of other things. It, it's like the more you have, the more people will give you. And people will give Bob Dylan camels and buses and, uh, you know, busts of the pharaoh and sphinxes and all sorts of things they think Bob Dylan might like. I don't know what he does with them at the end of the tour. Wicked. And there, there you have it. you're down at ant level there's like king ants there's nobody ants there's queen ants there's hangers-on ants really there's hustler fair, ants it? no this isn't at all we did the great escape a couple of weeks ago um yeah this was the first like outdoor show now was the great escape did you enjoy that uh great escape was all right it was a bit of crazy it was an all day and it was just rammed from about four o'clock in the afternoon you couldn't move in there so yeah, it was good. It's just so popular uh, yeah people got there early <laughs> Uh, it's nothing to do with the other bands on the they bill. They stayed afterwards as yeah. well. After we played, they just stayed all night. Go on, Glass. <laughs> I think this might be the best thing you've ever blagged, I right? I can't believe you Who's going to be drinking it? I can't it? believe it. You need to come with us everywhere. <laughs> How is it? How it's is the, the best dish champagne I've ever had. <laughs> best things in life are free, apparently. <laughs> just too reserved. We're just like, reserved. oh no, it's okay, honestly, fine. We don't need any drink for our ride. Just just play in the car park, that's fine, we'll just do that. We'll just set up over here, we won't be too much trouble, we won't make much noise at all. Yeah, enough that's of fine. that, yeah. enough. What is the best thing that you've ever blanked, considering we're doing a blank right. vlog? Yeah. Well, it could be, well, we're playing a festival um, next month and Prince is playing the next day and it could be my ticket to see Prince the next day, a blank one. Wow. So we'll see, ask me after the Prince gig. I'm very excited. It's about five miles away from where I live. So Prince is coming to my town. I've got, I've got to go. That's pretty amazing. I've got to go. Traveling the leaves of the birds you meet.